Last time I was making a temporary boat cover. With the companionway hood closed, I have a bit of a problem gap here. <laughs> uh, it's going to be drafty and also rain running forwards down the hood all just come straight into the cabin here. So I'm going to add another piece of wood to fill the gap, uh, prevent the drafts and divert any rainwater forwards uh, by putting a, a slope on the front of it. That's the plan anyway. So I set about taking some measurements for the new piece of wood. Then transferred these to a scrap piece of plywood to make a template. I transferred the curve of the companionway slide onto this piece of wood and also the curve of the cabin roof. Time to check if the template fits. It's looking pretty good, just needs a little bit shaving off at one side. Once I'd done this I transferred the shape of the template to a scrap piece of wood which was actually three pieces of wood I glued together earlier when I was making the rudder and then never actually use this piece. It always feels good to put pieces of timber like this to good use. Next I sanded the timber to make the curves nice and smooth. I also put a slope on the front of the piece of timber so that rainwater would run off more easily. That seems to fit okay. I wanted to put some pieces of timber trim on the insides of the cabin and also have some rails to run some rope lighting behind. I found a suitably pliable piece of offcut sapili and started to sand this into shape.
Next I stuck some mounting blocks on the back of each trim. Then I prepared to fix everything into place. Using thickened epoxy resin. I pre-drilled the holes for securing the piece of wood across the companionway so it was quite easy to find these again with the tips of the screws protruding out of the wood. These screws of course will be taken out once the epoxy resin has set. I didn't want to put screws through the pieces of trim since these were going onto the cabin walls and also I didn't want to spoil the appearance of them. So I resorted to using some strips of gaffer tape and some bits of wood clamped together so that we're pushing the trims onto the sides of the cabin. <laughs> 